Happy race day, everybody. We have the new Atlanta Super Speedway today. Um, but just to recap last week, I mean, yeah, it, I was interested to see, Marin, how long the win streak was going to go. We did end up going eight straight. Win streak came to an end, sadly, uh, with Tyler Reddick in the victory at Road America. We did finish second. I had the nine, and you had Larson uh, in third, so a, a two-three. It wasn't much you could do there. I mean, Reddick had a great car. Uh, but now we move on to Atlanta, where, I mean, if you like to play darts, then this is your kind of race. I mean, there's no data, really. It's, it's you know, for those who don't know, Atlanta was repaved. They changed the embankment. They made it a super speedway. Um, you know, <sighs> what can I even say? You know, no practice, no qualifying. We really only have one data set to look at, which is the spring Atlanta race, which was won by William Byron. Um, problem is, you know, I don't like to look at one thing and think that's going to repeat. Usually, especially a super speedway, it does not. So I'm looking at the odds here. Um, really, every pick is a value pick. When the favorite of the race is plus 1,000, we got three guys at plus 1,000 here, which is Chastain, Blaney, and Elliott. I mean, best thing to do uh, at a race like this is just decrease the unit and get on more drivers. Go to the guys that are typically good on super speedways. If you want to get value, you can go down to see the McDowell's of the world, uh, Eric Amarola's, um, Eric Jones, Chris Buescher, Brad Kozlowski, um, all guys plus 3,000 or higher. Uh, you know, for me personally, um, like I said, it's really a dartboard situation. <sighs> Probably taking a look at Blaney and Elliott plus 1,000. Um, shorter down the board, I mean, Bubba Wallace plus 1,500. He does have the new pit crew. They took some of uh, Chris Bell's pit crew and put them over on there because his pit crew was so bad. So. Oh, because he yelled at them? Yeah, and then he uh, pulled a swap or something. So, I mean, maybe that'll matter. Um, you know, I like that idea. I mean, you know, this is the kind of logic. Like, I mean, you know, you got really nothing to go on here. So, uh, further down the board, as I mentioned, Busher's at plus 3,000. And, you know, you got McDowell at plus 3,500. Not so good here in the spring. Brad was a little bit better, plus 4,000. So, I think I'm going to do my, my big value picks, uh, the RFK boys. The 6 and the 17, Brad Kozlowski and Chris Buescher. Mm -hmm. uh, and then I'll go with Blaney, Elliott, and Bubba. Okay, cool. So, super speedway in Hotlanta means that I am super randomly picking. Um, I think I'm going to go with... Mm, let's go with... Let's go with Bubba Wallace. Okay, same one I have there, plus 1,500. Okay, and I'll go with Bowman. Bowman is down plus 2,500. I can't recall how he was here in the spring, but we'll see. He, he's been up there on them, you know, we'll see. Okay, and then let's try uh, Hamlin. Denny is a consummate presence at the Super Speedways, and he's plus 1,200, and he's got that new Coca-Cola car today. Sharp-looking Camry. Oh, okay. So, all right. I mean, there you go. Good luck. I mean, the smart thing to do is really not to bet this race at all. But if you want to go ahead and throw a couple darts and hope one lands, go for it. Happy darting. Happy darting.